Hey, what's up, everybody? Joey J. Ping here, Respect My Region Buddies brand. We're here in San Bernardino. I got Sean Kiernan from the Wood for Warriors Project. Wanted to talk a little bit about what you guys do here with this project, what it means to be here with the veterans, and hear it from the man himself. Right. We are here in San Bernardino at Stizzy with SB 34. SB 34 is Senate Bill 34. was passed uh, by Senator Weiner out of Sacramento in 2019. What 64 did was it took patients away from the progress and became taxes to the government and the retail owners, the license owners. The patients, therefore, no longer could donate medicine because they taxed free medicine, yep. right? So it effectively shut down the donation, and that's why we have such a big illicit market. So what SB 34, it recognizes patients, especially people on 100% disabled veteran gets 3000 approximately a month from the federal government. A $40 eighth would be three joints. They'd go through that in a day. Yeah times 30 is twelve hundred dollars so just as an example of why they can't medicate in the legal market and there's such demand it's because prices the inefficiency the taxes the regulation and so what we do here with the support of these awesome brands and stizzy behind us because we need the license holder we get donated meds to veterans so they can use it to substitute things opiates psych meds alcohol illicit drugs it's a safer substitute every place we're seeing it we're seeing lower suicides lower overdoses, lower domestic violence it is the best choice for many of these veterans. And that's why we're seeing more veterans, more non-veteran patients choose cannabis over all those other legal and illicit substances that you can buy in every community in the state of California. Well, we really appreciate what you've done. It means a lot. I've talked to a lot of veterans here today. And to get the stories from them and to right. hear them and see the impact and the smiles and shake hands, I have to say, I appreciate what you do on my end. I have veterans in my family. so We all do. Thank this you. is the best way I can say it is we get kids who come up to me and say, thank you. You gave me my dad back. You gave me my mom back. That's, that's you know, where it yeah. touches. Because it makes family a cohesive unit again. And that's what's missing in most of these veterans' life. And that's why they love to come out here. Because they come out here, they don't get out a lot. And they, you know, get along with their yeah. fellow vets, get to talk. Caregivers come out and say, I'm not alone, right? No. My husband, my wife exhibits the same issues. I have people in my shoes. It's really about community and uplifting that community. Beautiful. Awesome. Thank you for Very your much. time. Appreciate you, sir. Thank you. Thank you.